For the last three months, we've had our eyes on a wonderful estate for scaling our nature recovery work vertically. It's the Tavialloc estate in Argyllshire. And today I'm happy to announce that we have secured the funding to actually acquire that. And we're on track to close the deal by the end of March and then enjoy a, a wonderful programme of nature recovery and cooperation, collaboration with the local community uh, to fulfil our purpose of community prosperity. In our current fundraising campaign, we've been very successful with crowdfunding and we now have more than 500 investors in the company, which is great. And mass ownership is very much part of our model. We've tried and failed to bring financial institutions along to invest in nature recovery. They never have yet invested in a nature recovery company, and they're going to have to if we collectively are going to hit the Scottish Government's targets and the targets agreed by getting on for 200 governments in the recently agreed Global Biodiversity Treaty. We will be back to ask them again in six months to a year, but it's disappointing that they feel that it's too risky to invest in this kind of thing at this point. Whilst we're disappointed that the big investment funds, pension funds, insurance companies haven't invested this time round, we're encouraged by the feedback from some of them, which is that they like the mass ownership component of our model. Uh, and that means that if a citizenry wilder invests at the level of 50 to 100 pounds, say, it makes it more likely each time that happens that one of these big institutions will come and invest at the 50 million to 100 million pound level, which is what the planet needs if we're going to hit the biodiversity targets that will get us away from biodiversity collapse.